It is a growing field and it's already saving lives. Genetic testing is helping to identify the inherited risk of people getting major diseases such as cancer, and it's a test our Megan Woods recently took. Megan is live tonight with a story of how genetic testing uncovered something extremely important for one local mom. This Farmington Hills woman, just like me, had her blood drawn, her genes screened for any connection to hereditary cancers, except her results showed she had Lynch syndrome. Which I had never heard in my life about, and I was like, okay, what does this mean? Serena Odin says cancer genetics wasn't on her radar, but then she saw her primary doctor for physical. The question was, how's your family doing? And at that time, my dad had just got diagnosed with uh, prostate cancer and colon cancer. My mom has a type of leukemia and my grandmother had breast cancer. Serena's doctor suggested genetic testing and good thing they did. Dr. Dana Zakalik, director of Corwell Health's Nancy and James Grossfeld Genetic Center in Royal Oak, says Lynch syndrome is serious. We know that Lynch syndrome is present in about one in 30 individuals with colon cancers and it is a very important, very significant cause of increased risk of colon cancer uterine, as well as a series of other cancers. But finding out you have it is not a death sentence. Instead of starting screening at 45, which is the latest American Cancer Society recommendation, we start as young as 20 to 25 for some of the Lynch genes. We uh, do uh, uterine cancer surveillance. We talk about healthy diet, doing colonoscopies every one to two years. I did actually have two polyps. Um, two or three, I think. And so they were able to remove those. And just think if I had waited until the recommended ages of 45, you know, it might have um, developed into something else. Her advice to others with a family history is don't let fear stop you. Because sometimes the what ifs gets in your brain and it keeps you up at night. And I like to sleep. Being able to know this information and working with my doctor, I think it's amazing and it makes me sleep better at night for sure. <laughs> Serena says she's been trying to get her brother to do cancer genetic testing and today he made his appointment. Her son is too young for testing, but she hopes someday he will get that done as well. I'm Megan Woods, Local 4. Hey, Megan, thank you. And cancer genetics can be a little overwhelming. Visit clickondetroit.com for online resources and upcoming events at Corwell Health for more information.